Welcome back. We are finalizing element 14 of your life book today. Yay! Transitioning eating to eating healthy for life. So um, we are just going to make this conclusion. So the last part of the element um, lets you know that your weight may fluctuate during transition as your body gets, you know, really used to the additional carbohydrates, the salt, and the calories. Remember to monitor your weight vigilantly and adjust your calorie intake up or down if you fluctuate by more than a few pounds from your healthy weight. If you notice you're gaining weight, cut back on the calories by um, recalculate your TEE. Maybe there's something going on there and adjust your intake accordingly. Please give your body time to readjust its lower set point um, and really be um, ready to catch yourself early. I like to recommend that people give themselves a three to five pound window. And when they see it get close to that, they go, wait a minute, what am I doing? So please know also your weight will never, well, it's not that it's never, but most people have daily fluctuations in their weight, 0 0.2, 0 0.1, whatever. Um, so just that's okay. So be mindful that that's why you want to give yourself a window. So yesterday I mentioned that um, I have a really important document that I wanted to make sure that you had um, before you begin transition. This is the healthy exchange list. So I'm going to review that. If you don't have this, please reach out to your coach. If you don't have a coach, shoot me a message. I'd be happy to um, send it to you um, because you really it's something that you really want to um, take a look at. So let me share my screen and see if we could get this to work. All right. So here is the healthy exchange options. This just goes through and tells you um, what a serving size is. So super important. So when we talk about fruit, it says here a, a fresh fruit, um, an app, a small apple, pear, or orange. So I want to point out that a four ounce apple is like this big. Okay. It's, it's not the ones you're going to go to the grocery store, you pick them up. That's about eight ounces. So the four ounce apples are the ones that are in a bag for the most part. The you know, oranges are like the little clementine, clementine size. All right. So please be careful. It talks about half a cup of chopped fruit, can half a cup of um, canned fruit, no sugar added. These are just ideas and, and um, of, of the serving sizes. So this is important. The fruit juice, four ounces, that's a half a cup. I know sometimes if you go out to breakfast and, or they used, I remember growing up and you want a glass of apple juice, it was probably a 16 ounce cup. Okay. That's not what you're going to have. All right, so take a look at that. Then um, it also gives you tips for fruit underneath it. Then there's dairy. Here's a fat-free or low-free, um, fat-free or low-fat milk. If there's a milk substitute, non-fat, once again, tips. Here's where you have your um, yogurt. When you get down to the protein, once again, here's some additional proteins. It has um, uh, all a series of things, tips. Serving sizes for starch, a piece of bread, or two slices of reduced calorie bread, right? Half of an English muffle, muffin, muffle, muffin, <laughs> hamburger or hot dog, a mini bagel, right? So these are just important to rice cakes. Um, once again, here's some additional tips. Here's healthy um, fats. Okay, take a look at that. Some additional tips, non-starchy vegetables. It kind of goes over again what that is. Half a cooked, um, half a cup of cooked vegetables. Um, and then, or a cup of raw vegetables. We do have a vegetable conversion chart that will probably make it easier. If you need that, let me know. Um, and then some additional tips. This also goes into alcohol and it has sweets and desserts, which are really for the, um, for free choice. They're about a hundred calories. So that's it for today. I hope that you enjoyed uh, going through this and I cannot believe we are finished element 14. I am so looking forward to element 15. Um, where we will continue on eating healthy for life. So, you know, the drill, please, please feel free, like, comment, share the post, hop on over to the YouTube channel called Healthy and Vibrant. And I look forward to seeing you next time.